hello students welcome back to my channel in this video i am going to discuss in detail about the multiple choice questions based on solutions the number of gram equivalents of the solute per liter of the solution is called as so number of gram equivalents per liter of the solution is called as the normality so option d is the right answer the sum of the mole fraction of the components of a solution is so in general a binary solution consists of only two components namely solute and the solvent so, so the sum of the mole fraction of solute and solvent is always equal to 1 so option b is the right answer the normality of one molar solution of phosphoric acid is so the formula of phosphoric acid is H3PO4 and coming to the relation between the normality and the molarity normality is equal to molarity into N factor N factor means it is the in case of acids it is the basicity so if you carefully observe phosphoric acid here three hydrogens can be replaced so here n factor is equal to three so on substituting so normality is equal to the molarity of the solution is one one into three so it is three normal solution so option d is the right answer A 500 gram toothpaste sample has 0 0.2 gram fluoride concentration. What is the concentration of the fluoride in terms of ppm level? ppm means parts per million. So in order to calculate the concentration of the any substance in ppm, we have to use the formula. So to calculate the concentration in ppm, we are having the formula that is equal to weight of the substance divided by weight of the sample into 10 power 6. So, in this problem here, what is the substance fluoride? So, fluoride weight is 0 0.2 and what is the weight of the sample? Sample is toothpaste. So, its weight is 500 grams into 10 power 6. So, on calculating it will be 400 ppm. So, the concentration of the fluoride in ppm is 400 ppm and hence the right option is c an aqueous solution of glucose is 10 percent in strength the volume in which one gram mole of it is dissolved will be so initially the strength of the glucose is 10 percent 10 percent means 10 grams of the glucose is dissolved in 100 ml of the solution and here the substance is glucose so the molecular weight of the glucose can be calculated from its formula that is C6H12O6 and it will be 180 and here 1 gram mole of the substance is dissolved 1 gram mole means especially 180 grams will be dissolved. So, 180 grams is dissolved. So, we are supposed to calculate how much volume contains 180 grams of the 180 gram of the glucose. That means 
here we have to calculate the volume simply do the cross multiplication that is equal to 100 into 180 by 10 and that is equal to 1800 and here if you carefully observe the options here the answer is given in terms of liters and hence it is exactly equal to 1.8 liter so option D is the right answer a solid dissolves in water in general solid is stable because of its lattice energy and when we are supposed to dissolve the solid in water definitely the lattice energy of the solid should be less than hydration energy and hence option B is the right answer The equivalent weight of an acid is obtained by dividing its molecular weight by its. So generally in order to calculate the equivalent weight of an acid that can be obtained from its molecular weight divided by basicity. Basicity means the number of replaceable hydrogen, hydrogen atoms and hence option B is the right answer. The normality of 4% NaOH is 4% solution means 4 grams is dissolved in 100 ml of the solution. And coming to the formula of normality, normality is equal to weight by gram equivalent weight into 1000 by V in ml. So that is equal to here weight is 4 grams gram equivalent weight of sodium hydroxide is 40. So 1000 by 100 and exactly that is equal to 1. So option B is the right answer. The normality of an aqueous solution of NaOH containing 8 grams in 2 liters of the solution is again here we have to calculate the normality molarity so molarity is equal to weight by gram equivalent weight into here the volume is already given in the liters so 1 by volume in liters so that is equal to here the weight of NaOH is 8 grams gram molecular weight is 40 into 1 by 2 so again here it is equal to 0 0.1 molar so option d is the right answer so what is the formula for molarity molarity is equal to weight by gram molecular weight into 1 by volume in liters so here in this case 0 0.1 molar solution will be obtained 1000 grams of calcium carbonate solution contains 10 grams of carbonate the concentration of the solution is so here also we have to calculate the concentration in terms of ppm so in order to calculate the concentration in terms of ppm we have to consider the weight of the substance that is 10 divided by the volume of the solution or weight of the solution that is equal to 1000 grams into 10 power 6. So that will be equal to 10,000 ppm. So here option A that is 10,000 ppm is the right option. If you like the video don't forget to like share and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.